Welcome to the Real Andy of Beverly Hills Show. Hello, everybody, troop. Welcome back. I'm the Real Andy of Beverly Hills, and welcome to another piece of tea of the day. Tea on the go today, girl. I mean. You know the deal, I am driving, so if I am not looking at the camera, it's because a bitch is trying not to die. Uh, but there's still so much tea to spill that, girl, I just need to take advantage of every second because my time is very short today. So anyways, uh, guys, get ready. We need to talk about Miss Lisa Barlow slash Sutton Strack from Beverly Hills. Girl, you, this was so so funny and we need to talk about it but before we get into it welcome back if you are new here welcome to the Beverly Troop where I keep it real and I mention it all so if you want to know what is happening with the pop culture streets inside of the Bravoverse and more well you know what to do subscribe 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 and hit that notification bell girl and let's talk about this oh mess so um, I think it was already like last weekend. There was the Hayu uh, Fan Festival, which is basically kind of like a mini BravoCon, but in it was in London. Okay, so if you don't know, uh, there is an there is a like a, a like an app like Peacock, you know, but for many of the other parts of the world that is called Hayu, and that's how many people watch Housewives and Bravo shows. So they decided to do, you know, this year was weird, was weird. There was not really like a BravoCon, but they have been doing a bunch of like little events, you know. Uh, they did one here in LA. They did another one in New York. There is one that is going to be happening in Miami pretty soon. And then Hayu decided to do the, their own festival in London for the European um, fans. And it was a success. Like, bitch, Bravo is a force. I am so proud of, you know, of them, of what they're doing, you know, and, and, and being a Bravo watcher. Like, I love, I love Bravo. I'm so sorry. Um, but anyways, uh, so I think, I don't remember, every, I, I know that Craig and Austin from Southern Charm was there, Lisa Barlow was there, Sutta Strug was there, um, there was a couple more people, you know. I think Sa Captain Sandy from Below Deck was there. And I know there was a couple more housewives. But anyways, this, I mean, that's not the tea. I mean, that, that event was amazing. And, and yeah. But part of, like, the promotional stuff that they're doing now is these little, like, videos. And there is this one between Lisa Barlow and Sutton Strack. And I have to tell you, this is a duo that I was not expecting. They are so damn funny and shady AF. Girl, so we need to talk. I think really this 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 video is about Sutton Strack and Lisa Barlow shading um Dorit Kemsley. Girl. I mean, girl. The things that they say, they're playing this game kind of like guess who, you know, but with housewives. And they were just start talking. So Lisa Barlow got Dorit Kemsley, you know, so she was trying to keep clues so, so, so Sutton could, like, guess who was it, right? When Lisa Barlow comes here and says, oh, um, she lives way beyond her means. And the direct response of Sutton was like, oh, Dorit. Girl. <laughs> I mean, it was it was too much. I was like screaming at the TV. Then uh, Lisa says like like yeah that they that they live way uh, Dorita and PK live way beyond their means, and that uh, and she says but she's a beautiful woman, right? And Sutton says well when you do uh, all, all that you know plastic surgery like anyone can be beautiful. Oh my God. I was like, oh no, she didn't. Oh no, she didn't. And this, literally, this 
interaction right there there are more more shady questions and stuff you have to go and watch it but it really cement my um theory you know that the next season of the real house of Beverly hills is not going to be all kumbaya my lord you know and it's oh we are all girlfriends living in a girlfriend's world like girl that is just not gonna happen okay like the bravo really is out there trying to say that all of these girls could be friends you know i could give us kind of like the same vibe as you know uh miami or new york or dubai and it's like it is not it's not gonna be like that it's not it's just not gonna be like that you know i think there is a lot of underlying animosity you know and and, and problems with this cast of Berry hills now Berry hills is known because you know we like to keep everything private no one like everything is on the surface everyone is like very fake but um yeah i know like like Sutton throwing this kind of shade. Come on, she knows that Dorit is gonna be watching this. She knows that this is gonna be part of the reunion. You know, probably Andy is gonna be asking these questions and what happens live. It's gonna create more storylines. I mean, Sutton is being extremely smart by throwing this shade out there, and also it's clearly telling us Sutton doesn't like Dorit. Period. You know. She doesn't like Dorit. Um, I don't know. I mean, I know that this season we're going to be seeing an activated Dorit because she had to fight for that check. Um, so I'm, I'm wondering how Dorit is really going to react for this. Uh, there, I mean, it is a couple of like very like heavy statements. You know, basically you're saying that she's broke and that the little money that she has is spending it on plastic surgery. <laughs> <laughs> so you know what I mean like at some point this is going to explode I'm here for it I'm here for a Dorit versus a Sutton uh, uh, situation and, and see who is gonna have what it takes to really win um, I'm excited now because something is telling me that the way that these things that Sutton are saying is coming from whatever happened during filming you know so she's definitely not happy with dorit whatsoever she's definitely doesn't think that she is a friend or anything i don't think she ever really considered she was a friend and it's going to be interesting to see how she managed the whole situation so you know what i got you girl sutton is my girl I have, I have many girls in Beverly Hills. Sutton is one of my girls. I think that she keeps it real. I think that she's not here to play like stupid games. I think that it's very, like, it helps the fact that she is not from California, you know? She's from Atlanta. So, I'm here. I'm, I'm, let's make it happen. Let's make it happen. So, let me know what you guys think on uh, the comments below. I mean, are you excited for this? this new beef that is brewing right in front of our eyes and come on let's not forget that lisa was also the one asking the question so miss lisa barlow also has a beef right there with dorit <laughs> that i am ready to explore because queen lisa look if you put lisa and dorit after each other i think that lisa will destroy dorit like she will take her down Okay, so imagine now Lisa and Sutton versus Dorit. Dorit will not survive. She will not survive. So anyways, let me know what you guys think on the comments below about a lot of this. What is your team? What do you think it happened? And if you want to get all the tea related to The Real Housewife of Beverly Hills or any of the other Bravo shows, make sure to like this video, share this video, subscribe to my YouTube channel, and I'll see you around. See ya. Bye.